it's Ellie Show with Young 40 Mom Crafts. I am a glutton for punishment because I am doing Vlogtober. Ah! <laughs> Today is Vlogus. Vlog. No, see, it's not Vlogus. It's Vlogtober. Vlogtober the first. Didn't realize there was such a thing until I saw No Catchy Name and she said she was doing her first, but she edits hers. Um. And does little clips, but I'm doing mine from my phone, and I don't know how to edit from my phone. I guess I could download a free program and do something with that, I guess. I, guess. I still have remnants of mascara under my eyes from going out with my friends Saturday night. My hair's still pinned up. And look, it's down. Look, look, look. I know, right? Got it behind me, but it's down. It's starting to finally get thick again. After I went perimenopausal um, for about four years, I was losing my hair. You can kind of see it's real, real thin in here. You can't see it when I've got it down, but and then the the way the white is right there, it doesn't really doesn't show too much. But anyway, this is about crafts, not my hair. Um, let's see what I got to show you today. I am going to be working on um, a few of my owls. I have finished a couple more Pikachu's. Let me get these down here. So they are packaged and ready for their home. I've got two of them ready to go. And I've got two more. Um, this is me in the making of, oops, upside down. Another one of my um, keychains, um, the um, minions. Yes, minion keychains. I have, what else have I got? I think I've got one in here already ready to go. Somebody wanted me to, I thought I had one in here. Oh, I already. I think I already, I already sold it. Nope, there it is. Okay. I did sell it. This is another one. I made three of them. So I made three of these. I've put them in their little homes. With my little tag. And the little... It doesn't have my business card in this one. I've been attaching my business cards to my bigger ones. But anyway, so um, this pattern you can find on um, Wooly Wonka's crochet I think that's her name I know it's Wooly Wonka W-A-W-O-O-L-L-Y-W-O-N-K-A all one word Wooly Wonka anyway um she's the one that had him in, in her background with her yarn and I would love to do that I've got enough yarn to have a wall of yarn I just have it you guys have seen I don't know if you can see it that's half of it the other half is in my craft room but anyway, um, so there's that. I'm in the process of making another baby. Um, here is the, you can't really, I don't think you can see the colors. This is going to be the bottom of it. I'm, ha I'm doing two threads. I'm doing this really, really pretty baby yarn. Um, that's this one right here. It's real pretty. And I didn't like how tiny it was becoming out because I was having to use like a 2.5 millimeter hook with that. And then I'm using this um, crochet thread. It's variegated purples. I'm just doing it together. And this is how it is stitching up. It's really pretty. And that purple thread is, is real shiny, so that's nice. So I'm in the process of making another one of my um, Sleepy Time Babies. Here is the head when it ever gets finished. This one has on heavy mascara. Um, I am in the process of making a Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty does not have a mouth, but there's, and yes, that is sparkly purple yarn on the bottom. There's, there's part of Humpty Dumpty. Um, let's see, Humpty Dumpty has some legs somewhere in this mess. This is the mess I'm looking through. So these are going to be some of my other owls. I have to stitch the top of it up. I have to do the eyes, the wings, and the beaks. So I've got... Let's see if I can bring this over here. It'd be a lot easier for you. Um, let's see. Let's see those. See all those that I have to stitch up and finish. I've got to finish all of those. I have got to do my tutorial for my spaghetti and meatballs play food. If you guys are interested, um, I am going to do a tutorial on that. This is my own uh, creation after looking at some uh, pictures and images for play food, um, make spaghetti and meatballs. I am going to do little medallions of um, sauce for it. And when I sell it, I'm going to package it in um, a styrofoam bowl inside of a bag. 
um, so that they can take it out of the bag and they can have it in a bowl and have their own little pasta fiesta. So I thought that'd be fun for the kids. Um, let's see. Ramsey, you just got to get right up in there, don't you? Right up in there. Oh. Okay, well, I was going to show you what the owls look like. Okay, here's a... There's one I've got done up. Oh, that's not a good one. That's an orange one. That one doesn't show the beak very well. Oh, the green one shows the beaks very well. So there's what the... They look like. Isn't that cute? They turn out so cute, the little, little green ones. Anyway, there's that. I've got I've got a bunch of them packaged up. I took pictures of them. Here's a purple one. And then I did some with eyes. Let me show you the one with the eyes because those those turned out really good. I like the one with the eyes. So there's one with the eyes. And little little wings and the beak. And a little packaged packaged and ready to go to a new home. So. Um, let's see what else have I got to show you since we talked last. Okay, I've got, uh, somebody was interested in having a sunflower blanket done. So I did up a couple of, um, granny square, sunflower granny square, um, examples. So here's one. Let's see if I can get a good, good coloring on that. Oh, maybe not. Eh. Ooh, my age is showing when I do any of this on my phone. It's so so funny uh, hard knock life hard knock life anyway uh so there's that okay and then here is the other sample the, and this one has a hole a normal hole can't see it with this light it's too dark anyway so this is the other granny square sunflower but instead of a blanket she just, she asked me if i would make her a handbag so I'm going to have to dig my sewing machine out um, from the back craft room and see if I can't do something about that for her. But anyway, so that's what I've got. Um, guys, give me comments. Young 40 Mom Sales is my Facebook page. And right now we are at, uh, last time I checked, we were at 70 members. If I get 100, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. If you share, you get an extra entry. Or if you... Um, Invite anybody you invite, you get an extra entry. So there's that. Um, you'll have to go to you'll have to go to Facebook and do a search for Young Forty Mom. I think it's Young Forty Mom Crafts. Maybe it's Young Forty Mom Sales or Young Forty Mom Crafts. Young Forty Mom, just Y R U N G four zero M O M. And if you do that, um, you'll be able to find it. If you want to go um, check out that uh, Facebook group that I've got going on. Um, I was trying to do a sales page, so that way you're up to date on anything that I might have to offer for sale. Or if you are a crocheter and you're interested in the pattern for whichever, anything that I'm doing, um, you can discuss, we can discuss it there and I can give you the um, information. If you're interested in crocheting, whatever it is that I'm doing, um, if I can uh, find the patterns for whatever I'm doing, I will hook you up. <laughs> Um, yeah, this, uh, this, uh, this month will be cross stitch related as well. So guys, I've got a giveaway going on that's got cross stitch stuff going. Um, and I think an embroidery kit, maybe it's a cross stitch kit, an embroidery kit, cross stitch books. Anyway, um, check that out as well. That is on my YouTube page. Um, but, um, yeah, if I get up to back up to, well, if I get to 1500, um, subscribers on my YouTube channel again, um, I'm going to do a huge giveaway. I'm going to do two. I'm going to do one for the yarn people out there and one for the cross stitch people out there. So, yeah, because that will just tickle me to death and get me back up there. Anyway, I will see you guys in the next one tomorrow. Bye. Peace out.